every once in a while we have one or two items that we'd love to display and i made this for myself and i really want to share with you guys how i made it and let's get into it these are the items we'll be needing the list of all the items will be in the description box below we're going to start off by gluing the beads around the corners of the mirror It has to be aligned properly so you can have a perfect circle. And when we're done with the top, we're going to repeat the same thing for the bottom. This is what we have and now we're going to cut a singular strip from our bling roll to cover the edges. I forgot to mention that before you start the project, you need to take off the stickers and the pads at the back of the mirror. I glue the blings with a hot glue gun and I turn into the back and glue the beads again like I did at the top at the back. Now we're going to take two beads and glue them together and a singular bead glued at the top forming a pyramid design. Now this is what we're going to be gluing at the top of the design that we initially had on the mirror. between two beads is what we're gonna leave before gluing the next design and we're gonna continue with that same pattern until we get to the end it's looking pretty already now we're gonna take our candle holder flip it to the bottom and glue it down we're gonna be flipping our designs over and safely keep it on top of an object so we can have a proper location of the middle I'm gonna secure it down with an A6000 glue and here she is. It's so pretty and it's a very nice statement piece. I chose the size of mirror but you can choose a bigger mirror for this design of course but I mean this is so that you can have that one or two pieces that you really want to show off. This can also be like a gift item that you can give like your mom or your sister or your loved one. In my opinion, it is so cute because it's petite. That means small or little in French. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys would like to make this same design on a bigger mirror or on the same size of mirror as I used in this video. This was an interesting DIY and I hope you guys enjoyed the video and remember to like and share. Thank you so much for watching and I have other videos linked in the description box below to check it out and don't forget to click on the subscribe button.